this video, I'm going to show you how to make southern style deviled eggs. From Easter to warm weather barbecues to family gatherings, these classic deviled eggs are always a hit. Try your hand at making this recipe for your next holiday. It will be on my Easter table this year for sure. Let's make them. Start out with some hard boiled eggs. I have a video on easy peel eggs that you can go back and watch if you have any trouble. I will link it in the description below. Once I peel and wash my eggs, I cut them in half lengthwise. I then empty my yellows or my yolks in a bowl and put the whites on a serving dish. Once I have all my yolks in a bowl, I mash them with a fork until they are in crumbles. Then I add my salt and pepper, pickle relish, mustard, mayonnaise. Now, as I said earlier, I'm making southern or classic deviled eggs today, but you can change this recipe many ways to suit the occasion or your preferences. For instance, I like sweet pickles in my eggs, but others like dill in theirs. I like Old Bay seafood seasoning and chopped shrimp in my deviled eggs sometimes too. And the list goes on. I see people make them, they top them with bacon, olives, cheese, onions. Once it is mixed well, grab a spoon and give it a taste. If it is to your liking, grab a spoon, or in my case, two spoons, and start filling your white halves. Another thing to mention here is sometimes it seems you run a little low on filling. One way to avoid this is to put your yolks in a small food processor and then add one extra whole boiled egg, the white and the yellow. Crumble it all together with the processor. You will not see the white in it when you're done. Now I just dip my filling into the white halves with two spoons, but if you want it more decorative, you can put your filling in a piping bag and put it in that way. Leave me a comment below on how you like your deviled eggs, or better yet, share with us what will be on your Easter table. Then I cover these eggs with saran wrap and I chill them for at least an hour before serving. Now here's a fun fact for you. Did you know that deviled eggs are usually served cold and can be the appetizer, the side dish, or even the main course? And did you know the term deviled in reference to foods is most common with zesty or spicy foods, including eggs prepared with mustard or pepper? Hmm. If you enjoyed this video, you will probably enjoy some of my other Easter menu ideas. I'll put a playlist at the end of this video. I hope y'all have a happy Easter, and I will talk to you in the next video.